Sorry, I just had to smoke a little crack to get through this. All right, so everybody that thinks that anybody with more than, I don't know, a billion dollars at their disposal is looking out for anybody other than themselves, just stop, just stop. Stop defending these fucking billionaires that don't give a shit if you die of hunger in front of your kids, bro. Like, these people are fucking heartless, soulless creatures. How the fuck you think they got to such a power? Not by helping people. I'll tell you that shit right now. They stepped on motherfuckers to get there. Motherfuckers had to suffer for them to be where they are. So don't you dare tell me that Elon Musk is going to fucking save free speech. You got to be fucking goddamn kidding me, dog. You know, I used to have some respect for the guy because I thought that his purpose was noble. But due to recent events, turns out fucking Muskie, he's got his own fucking world domination plan. And you know, it's pretty fucking obvious. I just chose to believe in the good in humanity, but I don't even think this motherfucker's human, to be honest with you. Like, dude's trying to fucking implant fucking devices in your fucking brain, okay? He's already got a fucking humanoid army in the works. He's got rockets coming in and out of our atmosphere. And now this motherfucker owns the platform that everyone chooses globally to go to for their information, which by itself is fucking stupid, man. Like, that is the senseless, the most desensitized shit I've ever fucking heard of. You go into Twitter for your information, bro? Maybe at the beginning, before the bots took over, maybe then it was a qualified source of, you know, useful information. But at this point, you're basically logging onto Twitter to get your cognitive dissonance amplified. Like, you're already dissonant. You don't want to hear what I'm saying right now because it's the truth, and the truth fucking hurts. And unfortunately, we've come... We've we've entered a world where if you don't agree with me, you don't have to listen to me. You can just fucking skip and go to the next motherfucker until you find one that's going to say what you want to hear. So, remind me again how that's beneficial to us at all? Like, I seriously want to know. I'm not making this fucking video for likes or fucking fame or fortune motherfucker i don't make anything off of the fucking shit i put online and i fucking should be i should be i should be up like a few hundred thousand for all the fucking streams that i fucking stream with my music but that's besides the point i don't fucking make it for you know um for recognition it would be nice to make the fucking equivalent pay and better believe i'm gonna fucking figure this shit out and get my fucking fair pay but I don't do it for that. I do it because I want to connect with people. I want to make sure that I'm not alone in this. So when I say something, I'm doing it so that you can fucking chime in. There's no fucking wrong answer. This is all speculation at this point. There's so many fucking puppet masters and people pulling strings behind the scenes that we don't fucking know about. That at this point, it's all speculation, man. Until we see fucking 3D fucking proof. Any fucking conspiracy theory at this point is possible. Like, no bullshit. And I'm a fucking logical motherfucker. I will not fucking go down that road unless you fucking show me some evidence. Like, for instance, I believe in spirituality, okay? I believe that we can all manifest whatever we truly desire. Why do I believe that? Because I've actually done that. I have seen the proof. First hand 
okay? I'm not going off of what somebody told me or this tarot reader said this or whatever. The algos showed me this video. No, motherfucker. I've been manifesting since I was a fucking kid, since before I even knew what the fuck I was doing. So please, somebody, like, explain this shit to me. But the reason that I'm making this fucking video is because ever since Muskie bought this fucking garbage piece of fucking internet landfill, guess what happened to me? I only had seven followers, bro. Like, I just started this fucking account in February. I have seven followers, bro. And now, guess what? Let's try to tweet something. Something went wrong, but don't fret. Let's give it another shot. Sure, I'll stay here pressing this for no fucking good reason, thinking that you're going to fucking do what you say. Your account is suspended and is not permitted to perform this. Learn more. Basically, your account is permanently suspended. After careful review, we determined your account broke the Twitter rules. Your account is permanently in read-only mode, which means you can't tweet, retweet, or like content. You won't be able to create new accounts. If you think we got this wrong, you can submit an appeal. Well, motherfuckers, I submitted an appeal, but it's not even an appeal. It's simply a request to explain why I broke the rules. I haven't heard anything back. It's been a couple days. So I'm deciding to read the rules out loud and figure out which rule I fucking broke. Which is very fucking, it's very up in the air. Like, I, I'm not doing anything that other people haven't done and continue to do with no accountability. So, about suspended accounts, we're committed to moderating the public conversation and creating a safe environment for everyone on Twitter. We may suspend accounts that violate Twitter rules. Okay, show me the Twitter rules. Oh, sorry, this page doesn't exist. You don't fucking say. See what I'm talking about? Where's the Twitter rules? Uh, okay. Why might my Twitter account be suspended? How to unsuspend your Twitter account? How to deactivate your suspended account? How to request a copy of your personal information? You know what? Let me get that, actually. Yeah, let me get that, motherfuckers. What do you mean, how can I help? I want my fucking Twitter information. I need access, motherfucker. Why do I need to explain that to you? It's my information. You see what I mean? And you motherfuckers over here kissing, billionaire ass, straight worshipping the very motherfuckers that step on you, that don't even consider you human. I'm going to put other and I'm going to put all, motherfucker. Oh, you want a fucking ID, huh? Whatever, I'll finish that later. So, check it out. Let's start with this one. Twitter rules. The Twitter rules. Twitter's purpose is to serve the public conversation. Violence, harassment, and other similar types of behavior discourage people from expressing themselves and ultimately diminish the value of global public conversation. Our rules are to ensure all people can participate in the public conversation freely and safely. Safety. Violence. You may not threaten violence against an individual or a group of people. We also prohibit the glorification of violence. Learn more about our violent threat and glorification of violence policies. Um, that literally happens all day on Twitter. Terrorism, violent extremism. You may not threaten or promote terrorism or violent extremism. Learn more. No, motherfucker, I wanted to learn more here. That's why I came here. Child sexual exploitation. We have zero tolerance for child sexual exploitation on Twitter. Well, yeah, you better, motherfucker. Abuse and harassment. You may not engage in the targeted harassment of someone or incite other people to do so. This includes wishing or hoping that someone experiences physical harm. Learn more. Motherfucker. No, I, I came here to learn more. Hateful conduct. You may not promote violence against, threaten, or harass other people on the basis of race, ethnicity, national origin, caste, I don't know what the fuck that means, sexual orientation, gender, gender identity, religion, affiliation, religious affiliation, age, disability, or serious disease. How about fucking being mega wealthy and manipulating the fucking population? Can I fucking promote fucking hateful conduct then? No, because you motherfuckers love being the villain. You'd rather be feared than loved. 
and you and, and all you motherfuckers that worship these fools, I feel sorry for your kids, man. Teaching them to idolize these fucking heartless creatures. Perpetuating a perpetrator perpetrators of violent attacks. We will remove any accounts maintained by individual perpetrators of terrorist, violent extremists, or mass violent attacks, and may also remove tweets disseminating manifestos or other content produced by perpetrators. Suicide or self-harm. You may not promote or encourage suicide or self-harm. Motherfucker! If somebody's gonna hurt themselves, if these motherfuckers are gonna, this is fucking ass backwards, dog. Sensitive media, including graphic violence and adult content. You may not post media that is excessively gory or share violent or adult content within live video or in profile or header images. Media depicting sexual violence and or assault is also not permitted. Illegal or certain regulated goods or services. You may not use our services for unlawful purpose or in furtherance of illegal activities. This includes selling, buying, or facilitating transactions in illegal goods or services, as well as certain types of regulated goods or services. <laughs> what the fuck? Private information. You may not publish or post other people's private information, such as home phone number and address, without their express authorization and permission. We also prohibit threatening to expose private information or incentivizing others to do so. Non-consensual nudity. You may not post or share intimate nude, uh, intimate photos or videos of someone that were produced or distributed without their consent. So I'm just going to put this out there if you didn't notice. like I haven't done any of these things. All right? Maybe I've come close to... I mean, not even harassment because I'm not fucking saying to hurt people. Like, I'm not trying to cause physical harm to anybody. I'm simply trying to bring light to this fucking crap of darkness that we're in. Hateful conduct. I'm not promoting violence. I'm not threatening motherfuckers. So I haven't done any of these, right? I haven't done any of these fucking bitch-ass rules that don't make no fucking sense in some cases. <clears throat> authenticity, platform manipulation, and spam. You may not use Twitter services in a manner intended to artificially amplify or suppress information or engage in behavior that manipulates or disrupts people's experience on Twitter. Hmm. I kind of feel like that's what's been happening to me. So is somebody breaking the rules here? Or is somebody getting the fucking rules broken on them? Civic integrity. You may not use Twitter to Twitter services for the purpose of manipulating or interfering in elections or other civic processes. This includes posting or sharing content that may suppress participation or mislead people about when, where, or how to participate in civic process. Misleading and deceptive identities. You may not impersonate individuals, groups, or organizations to mislead, confuse, or deceive others, nor use a fake identity in a manner that disrupts the experience of others on Twitter. Synthetic and manipulated media. You may not deceptively share synthetic or manipulated media that are likely to cause harm. In addition, we may label tweets containing synthetic and manipulated media to help people understand their authenticity and to provide additional content. Copyright and trademark. You may not violate others' intellectual rights, including copyright and trademark. I haven't fucking broke any of these rules, bro. Learn more about our approach to enforcement. Yeah, we're going to go there in a sec. So... The only one that I can see that I might have um, broken is this third-party advertising and video content. You may not submit, post, or display any video content on or through our services that include third-party advertising, such as pre-roll video ads or sponsorship graphics, without our consent. So that one is a little fucking gray and could be a possibility. But check it. Now I'm going to go through all the fucking tweets I've ever made. And you can tell me which one I fucked up on. Which one did I break the rule with? Because, what? I can't even look at my own, there it is. All right, tweets and replies. The last one, which I'm almost certain, I'm almost certain that this is the reason why I got permanently suspended. So first of all, let's read my about. It says, whoever normalized massive extortion of musicians is my only mortal enemy. Art and science is one and the same. Sound is the foundation. Emit your highest frequency. How the fuck is that harmful? Did I threaten anyone? No, motherfucker. I offered fucking information of value, actually. So look, I'm not even calling Homeboy by his real name. But you know goddamn well who I'm talking about. And you know goddamn well he is a grifter, by definition. 
So Ken Grifter, you may be winning the battle, but you will not win the war. Never underestimate the lows people will sink to in order to hold on to a materialistic facade of power. Lift your souls, humans. Tell me how that's promoting harm. I'm simply saying that I'm defending myself, and we should all do the same by lifting our souls. Okay? That was the last tweet that I ever made. I predict, and then I'm going to just keep going down the line. I predict a market crash harder than it ever has. Mega wealthy will sell high and buy low and become wealthier. The working poor will foot the bill and keep the cogs functioning. While a selected few will capitalize on mistakes by the 1% and win the war for good. Okay, look at, look, check this out. Check out the analytics. Oh, oh, I actually got 33 people that seen that. Nice. That's actually high for mine. See, 11. That's still pretty high. <clears throat> but I guarantee you that 9 out of the 11 were fucking bots. Twitter bots. They're fucking rampant on Twitter. You see all these accounts with no pictures? They're just memes or fucking NFTs? That ain't a fucking human, bro. It's a fucking bot that has a script that sticks to that script. Got all you motherfuckers confused on me. It says, <clears throat> April 28th, AMC never leaving because of all the bag holders. Apes not leaving because that's what apes do. I'm not leaving to prove a point. We are not built the same, buddy. All of a sudden, now my, now my tweets get all kinds of fucking look, eyes on them. So I commented, oh, you can't even see my picture. Wow. It was a picture of my fucking tattoo on my arm. It's fucking great. Anyways, I just tattooed. I said, that's a banger. I call my PFL player for life. She said, love it. Fire. Emojis. Okay. I guess that was violating Twitter rules also. She said, being kind to others allows you to be kind to yourself. The way you speak about someone else becomes a reflection of how you feel about yourself. I said, also, try doing some mirror work. That that opened up the old noodle a bit. I said, would, I would love to know if anyone besides DK Blue can see any of my tweets. He said, I see you, fam. And we got multiple comments on that one. Look at that. Dude, I swear to God, the other day I checked and it said impressions like 10. Now you're saying 544 now that I don't have a fucking account, you motherfuckers? This is awesome bullshit, man. Like, for real. I was starting to gain traction again, and you motherfuckers straight suspended me. There was more comments than that, too. Somebody noticed. I said, you like the only real one out this motherfucker, dog. Damn near everyone else has lost this in twit slation. Start starring Elon Musk as Ken Grifter. <laughs> Why is my brody? I don't even know what I just meant, but you feel me, partner. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. So, the last hedgy vendor says, I'm having so many new followers over a month now. So many new apes are joining to the movement. We are stronger than ever, and apes not leaving. AMC. whoop de whoop We got this. We are killing them one by one. Okay, okay. Okay. This motherfucker said, we are killing them. But my shit got suspended? So I commented on that, right? I said, okay, this is actually true, but you know these are bots, right? Like, all these fucking things are bots. That motherfucker's a bot, and that motherfucker's a bot, right? This motherfucker. This motherfucker. This might not even be a bot. This is probably the motherfucker behind the bots that programmed them, wrote the script. Country Pride Entertainment. Bring in eight more apes in now that want to fight the good fight. I said, bot, you're a fucking bot, bro. Added one more. Bro, you know these are bots, right? Like, this might be a human. But it might not be. They're starting to catch on, you know, that we're catching on. This dude said, great, we need to grow much faster. If we unite from a million here, the game will be over in one day, and the hedges will buy, bury themselves. For example, we have to get 500,000 signatures for a petition in one day. That would be, wow, huge, NFA. Obviously a fucking bot, bro. Obviously. So I basically went on and broke bot on everybody that I knew was a bot. So this dude said, Bill Huang arrested. Remember the RICO Act, folks. AMC, blah, 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 these fucking useless hashtags. And I put, that boy's tweaking. Look at his face, though, dog. It looked like he was fucking eating some ass out, too. Look at that fucking shit on his fucking lip. That shit on his lip. Got some shit on his lip. Okay, that's probably what got me fucking banned right there. 
fuck is that for? <laughs> this motherfucker right here. All roads lead to GameStop. Currently, BBY and AMC are sitting at around the same share price. The potential for BBY is far greater than that of AMC. If AMC hips think it's too expensive to switch to GME, why not just go with BBY? At least, at least then, you have RC, small flow, higher SI, and less debt. It says not, but it's supposed to say bot. You know that. Somebody fucking liked it. I don't know who. Probably this dumbass bot. It's just programmed to fucking like and comment. Next one is a tweet from me. It says, dog, Twitter's fucking stupid, which it is. It's for fucking momos to get their information. I said, can anyone explain what these prices are and why they go up so high? From my understanding, that's the spread. And if the spread, and if it is the spread, how the fuck is it so large? That's the spread on AMC. So right here, I'm just fucking telling you I'm live. I don't know why this is on my page. Thanks for your support, big dog. I'll be starting my live stream shortly. If you would like to join me, got beats like Chunk, got Cheech, whatever, right? There's no fucking harm in that. Buenos dias. No, no harm, bro. Look, check this one out. Twitter is not free switch, free speech, people. Twitter is the problem with free speech. A tech company that, with the power to deploy algorithms, promote narratives, suppress opposing opinions, is not free speech, son. I hate to burst your bubble at Elon Musk. Maybe Musk fucking had me removed. I don't know, man. It's... This one said, hell yeah, Trump takes out the trash that includes a handful of Republicans. I said, Trump is trash. Anyone who dehumanizes a demographic deserves to be rejected and forgotten. May you find the light that you so desperately need. All politicians do not have in the interest do not have interest in the general population's well-being. Fact check me. <laughs> I said, shadow ban these nuts, Twitter. <laughs> oh, man. I retweeted financial freedom, nothing less. And then I said, disillusioned by Elon Musk and the psychological warfare of a nation built on land that was stolen from the natives. And you're still complaining. But I'm the crazy one, right? Buenos dias. You smell that? It's called reality. If you scroll past this, you don't want to be rich. If you view this and don't engage with it, shame on you for pretending to give a fuck about your kids. Fame and fortune means nothing without love. Why you think the rich is so dead inside? I don't know what that video was. Probably one of my fucking videos. Freedom of speech is important, but you really can't have freedom of speech without freedom of money. If your money can be shut down, what freedom do you really have? That's true. That's why I retweeted it. It's fucking art that I retweeted. I've been trolling all morning and not a single backlash. Free speech is on fleek. Also, stop feeding the beast. The beast is the United States stock market. It's true. This guy said, my friend bought 15 AMC shares at 9 a.m. and already wants to sell. What should I tell him? I said, please do. There's too many b baboons as it is. And buying is not the answer. This motherfucker right here, rogue trader. Big market bounce should be coming here soon. I said, bro, everything you tweet is absolutely bullshit. Literally zero of your predictions have been justified, buddy. Truth does not compute. Check this guy said, defending billionaires against criticism isn't your job. They can afford people to do that for them. And then I fucking tweeted at the Illuminati, do you have the power to unban my digital presence? Or who do I talk to about that? Check this one. I said, fuck Ken Grifter and the rest of the short hedge fund circus. May your lives be full of emptiness, you greedy fucking schmucks. Namaste. How the fuck is that promoting violence, bro? Or, or any of that bullshit fucking rules I read. I literally fucking... I, I sent him on his way by saying namaste. May your life be full of emptiness. I mean, obviously, it is. You greedy fucking schmucks. Maybe they don't like being called schmucks. I don't know. It seems like when I say schmucks, they really get, like, it cuts deep. <clears throat> the amount of tweets these bots put out should be a clear indicator of the level of expansion that has taken place. If you muted me at any point because of the truth I tweet, then you don't believe in free speech. At Elon Musk. And then I was just calling all the bots out. This is a bot. This is a bot. That's probably a bot. Yeah, most definitely. Oh, well, maybe not, actually. This is a regular person. Just maybe don't want to show their face. I don't know. Um, but you see what I'm saying here? Like, dog, when the fuck did I break the rules? The United States free market is a mockery to freedom. You don't like athletes taking a knee during the anthem? How do you feel about 
elected officials and hedge funds shitting on your dignity. Just asking for a friend. She said, real friends tell you when they hate your tweets and haters funny how thin the line is. I said, social media's bot problem is going to be the way AI takes over if it hasn't yet. Check it out. Maybe, th maybe it's this one that got me fucking booted. Dear U.S. Federal Reserve, and I tweeted at them, you want to reverse infl inflation? Inflation. You want to reverse inflation? Stop hoarding the wealth. It's clear as day that the people at the top have no interest in equality, nor should they be in their positions because of the conflict of interest has reached a criminal level. That's fucking freedom of speech, motherfucker. I can say shit like that. But there is no fucking freedom of speech, man. It's a fucking fable. To say that any elected official gives the slightest fucks about humans is the greatest joke of all time. Fidelity is shady as fuck, bro. I will not be foxing with you anymore. Vanguard, don't let me down. That was before all the fucking bull... That's another thing, actually. I'm going to make another separate video for that. Look, this is when Elon first started flirting with buying Twitter. I said, yo, Elon Musk, bro, can I get a shadow ban removed? Ever since I called Ken Grifter and short headphone schmucks, my digital presence has been majorly hindered. For the sake of free speech, I call upon thee. Peace. Nothing, homie. Nothing. Nothing. No love, homie. This dumb motherfucker said, should Elon Musk bring back Donald Trump to Twitter? I said, fuck that puto. <laughs> so please, somebody, anybody, tell me I'm tripping, please. Like, I am desperately crying out for help right now. I need to know which one of those fucking rules I broke. I'm, I don't give a fuck about Twitter, dog. Like, I'm, I want to deactivate it and never fucking come back again. It's just the only reason I was on there was to reach out to people, to connect with people. And these motherfuckers, dog, acting like I'm the fucking problem. Get the fuck out of here, dog. For my next topic, I'll be talking about fidelity and how those motherfuckers and pretty much every broker dealer are straight up fucking evil and thieves. And we need to deal with this. We need to address this. But anyways, my iPad's about to die. My wife probably hates me. My daughter probably misses me. Probably just fucking wasted a whole hour of my fucking life. Because nobody's going to have the balls to listen to this all the way through. But if you did, kudos to you. Fucking share this with your friends. If you all want to see some real change. Other than that, go fuck yourself.